Now, Dan, the Daily M was last night, and like always, I believe you have some opinions on this one. Yes, I have some opinions. So, of course, the question is, is, is Ponga a deserving winner? The short answer is yes. The long answer is no, because Sean Johnson was the only option, and the fact that he doesn't have the medal around his neck right now says a lot about the system. Now, I don't blame Callum Ponga at all. He was tremendous, and at the end of the year, I am very much on record as saying he's the best player in the competition. If it was a who was the best player across the last 10 weeks, Callum Ponga wins by a mile. But it's a season-long award, and you cannot talk me out of Sean Johnson being the best player across the 27 rounds. I've written an article, which may be live by the time this goes up. If not, Scott, please get a move on, mate, because it is fire, where I pretty much criticise the system from start to finish. Last year, Nico Hines won in a record margin. I think that was a correct decision, biased as I might be. But I think if you look back, that was the outlier in the, the Daly M's across the last few years. I think he was the only one you could look and think, yeah, look, they, they got that right. And, and again, I'm not having a go at Pong. I thought he was very, very good. But this system of two people voting on three two ones means that if you have three or four good games, you can bank 20-plus points and be sitting in the top three. Then you can go away. Meanwhile, a player can be the second best player across two months and not bank the same amount of points. I have an issue with it. I put I'm not going to blow, I'm not going to go into what I suggested, but I've I've suggested not one but two better options, including one that I think doesn't come up enough, and that is using common sense. Who is the best player in the competition? The eye test is the test that I find is the most trustworthy and the most common sense. So please jump on, read it. Yay, Ponga, but also Boo Ponga, Sean Johnson for me.